Hello and welcome to my MSX special. First of all, something to the system. This is an MSX Sanyo. I got it from a fair, but my MSX career started with this one. This is a Philips 8010, and this is a Philips 8020, and this is my MSX2. So I prefer playing on this MSX1. And, oh, heavy. This MSX2. So, a lot of guys asked me, how about the games? So, we start with a little neat collection. We start with this one. Not so well known games. This is Sparky. I did a let's show about this. This is Dorodon, a puzzle wall something. This is Mause, just watch the label. This is something like Mouse Trap or Clone of My Trap. This is Battle Cross. This is not a so good shooter. Crazy Train as a puzzle with trains. <sighs> it's not so great. And the least favorite I think is Alibaba and the 40 Thieves, but it's not an awesome game. This is maybe mediocre or less. Coming to the next group. This is the games from hell. Not from this hell you know. This is the both Agaland games. So now you see them. Uh, this is the or maybe the origin of um, the Adventures of Lolo, this is nearly the same and deported on uh, the MSX system. So if you know these kind of puzzle games, it's the same. Rollerball is a nice pinball. It has multiple screens, but only one pinball system. But it's okay. Super Billiards is a typical pool billiard simulation. It's nice, but it's not the greatest thing. Dunk Shot is a very famous uh, basketball simulation. Um, it's a little bit glitchy, but it has uh, arcade parts and simulation parts. It's very nice. This was the games from Hill. And you heard were badly talking about Sony. So. Sony had his own collection of MSX as the Hitbit. This is the famous Load Runner. This is the MSX version of a Load Runner game. You should know that. If you don't know Load Runner, go home and play it. This is another golf simulation. I don't know if it's better than the Konami's Golf, but I think this was decent enough. This was a good chess. Nothing really spectacular, just chess. If you want to get a Let's Play from it, I don't think so. This is Music Studio G7, uh, music composer software, very okay, very nice, not very great, but uh, very useful. This is the only Philips module I have, a um, fighter simulation, flying sim, not so great, but I think it was maybe one part of a system. I got it maybe with a system. Now coming to the Konami game, starting with Chia Kung Fu. This game isn't really that great, but it's an arcade port. And if you see the arcade, the arcade itself is not very great. So uh, the port is okay, and this game, the second version, is a lot much better than the first one. So, um, not the grating fighting games, but decent enough to have it in the collection. Speaking of collection, we take some of these little games. This is Super Cobra, also an arcade conversion. Not the greatest thing on the planet, but it's nice. Athletic Land was my first ever MSX game. This is something like a clone of Pitfall with more child things, uh, so you jump about barrels, uh, 
about sea roses. Um, it's okay uh, and it's really interesting. It has uh, two ways. If you go to the right, what is the standard way, it's the hard mode and if you go to the left, it's the easy mode. Uh, I don't know it's a glitch, but it worked. Sky Jagger is not so good looking, but it's a decent shooter. Twin B, uh, something a little bit with a Gradius clone uh, or Nemesis clone. It's an okay shooter. The next Elva line. This is a good, a very good tennis game. If you don't know it, it's worth a play. Uh, this is a solid golf simulation, it's okay. Um, the soccer is not so great. It's okay, it has penalty shootouts, but it's not, not the best uh, football or soccer simulation. Uh, the golf and the tennis is better. Here you have a rally game with changing weather, but it's a little bit too arcade for me. Um, it's nothing like Colin McRae or something. Um, so, no, it's not really my thing. I have it, but it's I, I won't recommend it. The next ones. Are you surprised? If not, write in the comments. <laughs> So, the next one, Circus Charlie. Uh, I think you know this model because it's not very unknown. Um, maybe it's not very known, but it's, it's a nice circus uh, game, something like a circus version of track and field. It's okay. Maybe I'll show it in a let's show. It's, it's okay. This is Time Pilot, one of my favorite arcades. Um, and this is a very good port, but it's the easy mode. It's not as hard as the arcade uh, version, but it, it's very okay. This is something like a learning game, Monkey Academy. Should I say it's jump and run with maths? I think it's um, nearly as useless as uh, Donkey Kong Jr. math or something like that. It's You don't need that. Uh, the ping pong is very good, but it's not uh, the arcade version. The arcade version of the C64 is a little bit different. This is more the simulation part. The next four. You're surprised, huh? Da, 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 da. So, this is boxing. It's If you see the sprite models, it's very inspired by Rocky. Uh, it's nearly... Uh, yeah, a rip-off. Uh, it's not a great decent game. It's not laughing, uh, something like uh, Punch-Out or something. It's not in the same league. It's a decent boxing game, but just only with six opponents and three of, and they're just doubled, so you have only three opponents with uh, two different sprite sets. Uh, and it's a little bit too arcadey. This is a uh, standard pool billiard. It's okay, it's nothing really special, but it's, it does its job. Comic Bakery. Um, something like Burger Time, maybe. So you are now a baker, a baker, in a bakery and uh, you have to make uh, little cakes. The cake is a lie, you know. Um, and you're threatened by... I think they are raccoons, I think. Uh, and so you have to handle with care. It's it's interesting. Uh, it's it's nice. It's okay. Uh, this is Green Barrett in some parts of the world known as Russian Attack. This is maybe no, it's not maybe. It is the worst Konami MSX game ever created on this planet. Prove me wrong. This game lacks everything. Graphics are awful. The sound is nearly... Uh, where's just a drummer. And I think he, he or she does nothing else. Drums. The same rhythm over and over again. The controls are sluggish. Everything is slow. It is so damn awful. Don't get it. I think it's... Very I think it, the, the crazy thing for a collector, it's very expensive. I don't know why. It is the Shaq Fu, the Superman 64 of the MSX collection. It's so bad. 
And now we reached the 10 minute mark. So this was part four, uh, part four, of course, I started with part four. Um, this is Aliens starting with part four. No, nothing. This was the end of part one. We see us in the next part next week. Be impressed. Well, will be more. <laughs> see you.